It's a great day out here. Dogs are loving the sun. I got my plants here. Today I'm gonna to get into the garden. My corn salad, arugula, and spinach. My arugula really looks, um, it, it looks a little, like it was roughed up a little bit. I have a feeling that maybe the lights upstairs were a little too hot, but these have been hardening off outside for a little while now, so I'm gonna get them into the ground. So these are gonna go under my tunnel here. I already have some plants from last year in here. Okay, got a little bit of spinach that came back up. Got some kale that's going into its uh, second year. And then I got some of this corn salad here that looks awesome. I use the square foot gardening method, but I don't put, leave a grid on. What I found is that these skewers, wooden skewers, are perfect for making a square. So. They're uh, exactly a foot long, so watch, if I go like this, okay, I got the one square on there, and then I can put this one over here, the corn salad's a little bit in the way, and then I can figure out where my, my square is, and then I just line it up like this, and I make little squares with the skewers. So you can kind of measure this way first and then I can do it this way or you could just use an extra one and throw it in there okay so that's how I make my little boxes so I got my square and this is going to be for my spinach spinach is nine per square so I put my little label on here I'm going to go one two three three in the middle and then I'm going to do three down here okay so I'm going to just pop these babies out just like that put my first one over here I'm just gonna go right down the line. I prepared this garden for the season by throwing, um, you know, two inches, about two inches of compost, maybe even more. I just kind of fill up the rest of it with compost. These guys have been sitting outside for over a week now, hardening off. We had a little bit of snow, so I used my um, cold frame behind you to kind of throw them in there even when it's a cool day but there's some sun out. Okay so I'm going to make one more square over here so I just kind of pull these over. See that? These uh, skewers straight across. Okay, just kind of make it, pre-making some spots there. Okay we got the arugula and we got plenty of arugula here. But these look like they were Got a little too much heat up in her upstairs, but I bet you give them a few days down here in the ground under the tunnel, and they're gonna spruce right up. We have some 70 degree days coming up. I have a few of these that look like they're bolting the seed. That just shows you that they were probably a little too warm upstairs, but it's all right, no bother. I just won't use those. Get the mulch in here. Okay, this one's again, it's another one that's nine per square. This corn salad, I, I can't wait. I, over here I got some and I'm gonna let it go to seed. I hear once you let it go to seed, it's pretty hard to get started. I don't know, I had a lot of missed attempts of starting corn salad. Even when you look at this, um, th this thing I did, I planted a whole lot of seeds and didn't barely get, it looks like I won't even have nine of them to plant but they say once you get it to go to seed it just goes crazy they said you can't get rid of it once you let it go to seed it just keeps on coming up as a volunteer so I want to get to that point because that would be really cool hey guys we got uh, all our plants tucked back in under the tunnel I'll give you an update on them later um, it, thanks for watching guys you watching the channel really helps us out makes me really want to make you more videos and show you everything we're doing and I'm so glad that you guys are joining me on my kind of life experiment in doing many things here like gardening all right guys well if you like the video please like it share it with your friends and we'll see you in the next video thanks for watching